All right, take two. The first time I made this message, <laughs> it wasn't recording. I'm such a ding dong. Okay, I am making a video of a couple of dreams that I've had. Um, I struggle sometimes with putting everything up because I want to make sure that I'm doing God's will. And But I did listen to a couple of people on YouTube, a couple of brothers and sisters that said that uh, the Lord had told them that we are to share what we see. So that's simply what I'm doing. And I just pray that um, it's God's will to do this. So anyways... Just a couple quick things, a couple quick dreams. I haven't been on here in a while, but uh, I'll be honest. Lately, I've been having a lot of rapture dreams, and I've only had maybe one or two in the past. I mean, I just don't ever have them. But things have been changing with my dreams. My dreams have seemed to take off like crazy. I'm, I'm dreaming six, seven, eight scenes a night, every night, and uh, just about people that I know that I'm to pray for, people that are that really need help right now. Just all kinds of crazy stuff. But uh, the last couple of dreams I want to share with you is in one scene of a dream on March, or I'm sorry, May 31st, just a, about a week, a couple days ago. May 31st, 14, I was um, in an auditorium and I was shown a scene, just an ordinary scene in my life that would happen or that would pass that would be, it was crazy. I mean, I felt that it would be that day that Jesus was coming. It was so powerful in this dream. And I remember being really shaken up because when I saw this scene happen, I knew that it had either already happened or was... I remember thinking, oh my gosh, it's that close. And it was just like a like a, a simple scene. The Lord just showed me something that would happen in the course of a day or maybe a, a picnic that we would be invited to and go to. Okay, it was something like that, and when I saw the scene, I was shocked that it would be that close, like, in the dream I was thinking, the next day. But we know God's timing is not our timing. But anyway, super, super close. And then, um, last night, I had a dream that I woke up, I screamed, my scream woke me up. Brian and I were, that's my husband, we were going somewhere, and I looked up in the sky, and I saw two mountain peaks. You know how they, they form like a V, you know, two V side by side mountain peaks? I saw that, and I saw a moon above it. And then I saw the moon turn completely red, like blood red. And then the, the blood from the moon dripped down onto the top of the mountains and formed a very thick red V out of blood. And I looked at Brian, and I said, oh my gosh, are you seeing this? And then I looked to see where he was looking, and he was looking in the opposite direction at the same sign that was happening just on the other side of the sky. And I, I just knew in that moment that we were going home. So as I laid there watching this happen, I felt my body start to change. I felt a shaking. Um, whatever it was, it scared me so bad that I woke up. I, my scream woke me up. Woke me up. Um, I was in, in the dream. I was excited, but I was nervous because it was such a, I can't even put it into words, you guys. It was crazy, but I just was screaming in my dream at Brian or yelling and I woke myself up. <laughs> so that's what happened last night. And one other thing that I wanted to share with you guys, hang on, there was so many, so many things that the Lord is showing me lately. I knew there was something else I wanted to show you, to share with you guys, and I'm sorry, I can't remember it. We did the scene, we did the, well, and the Lord also showed me there's a lot of bad stuff going on in the church, which we all know that. Yeah. Um, yeah, I thought I had something else to share with you, but I think that's it about the two rapture dreams. Just, um, the uh, the one last night, and then the other one about the scene. Oh, I know what I was going to tell you guys. Um, in another dream, I was told to watch the weather. In the dream, I told this lady, an unknown lady, I said, a lot of people are saying this or that is going to be the signs of Christ coming back. And I was told to simply watch the weather. That is going to be the sign of Christ coming back. And as I believe a lot of you guys know, I feel that this is so soon. I mean, I'm just trying really hard to pray for my family because uh, my family's not in a good place right now and um but i think we we need to really get serious about this because it is super super close i mean i'm expecting it to happen anytime any second 
And when I went on YouTube and found out that a lot of other people were having these same dreams, I thought uh, I definitely needed to put it up. But all right, I'll quit rambling. God bless you guys, and feel free to comment. All right, bye.